Well, yeah, so the standard model, um, the first discovery that really solidified the standard model was just the discovery of the Z and W bosons in the early 1980s. That was actually just when I was um, in graduate school. And so since then, about uh, 30 years, we have simply been confirming that this model works with a few minor perturbations like the fact that neutrinos have mass. And so it's been a remarkable, um, robust theory. In fact, for someone like myself who spent their whole life confirming the standard model, we can't wait till we find something that doesn't confirm the standard model. It's always the things you don't know that are much more fun. Um, other, other things are, by their very nature, more speculative. Will we ever be able to confirm string theory? It depends on what size scale um, evidence for strings is shown or whether there are large extra dimensions that we can measure. So, you know, we don't expect string theory yet to have the same kind of um, evidence that something like the standard model has. The question will be whether it ever does, whether it's true or not. And as an experimental physicist, something that begins to have a preponderance of evidence or a lot of evidence, then we be, I begin to think that that theory has real validity.